We have an urgent update to talk about in the crypto market today for Pepe right now because what is happening in the crypto market is there is a lot of volatility. You guys can see the price bubbles right here. So we're going to be talking through this volatility, what's happening in the short term. We're also going to be checking out a very fresh crypto project that is about to launch very, very soon into the crypto market. So you guys are getting some fresh alpha. And also we'll be talking about the long term Pepe price. So what's going to happen in the future with Pepe the crypto? So if you guys enjoy the updates, hit the thumbs up button. And also, if you guys are staying bullish on Pepe in the long term, even though we've had volatility in the short term, uh, make sure to hit, hit the thumbs up button on this video as well. It's a signal you guys are not getting rattled out of the crypto market right now. So if we actually do take a holistic look at uh, you know the Pepe price, there is volatility that is flowing into this crypto. You guys can see these waves starting to form in the crypto price for Pepe. And what's happened today in the last 24 hours, you guys might be able to spot this, but there is a ton of volatility, not only for meme coins, not only for Pepe, but this is basically across the board. So this urgent update, not not just about Pepe, but we are seeing retracements. I would classify it, you know, not only meme coins, but you are seeing a lot of cryptos actually retracing in the cryptocurrency market today. So you can actually see a massive cool off in BNB. You can see a big discount in the price of Bitcoin. So if we actually bring up the Bitcoin price, and this is one thing that will, you know, continue to impact the Pepe price. But if you have a look at the price graph right here, we have recently got a bit of a red candle forming here for Bitcoin. So you can see this, this will impact the entire crypto market. So generally what we want to see for Pepe, especially over the long term, is we definitely want to see this Bitcoin. It kind of acts like the sun in the crypto market. So the higher it goes, the brighter it shines, the better it is going to be for Pepe right now. And if we have a look at the market capitalization, so we are trading, you know, roughly $4.95 billion in terms of market cap. Long term, the price graph of Pepe is still looking super exciting, super bullish right here. But again, we are getting hit with a little bit of cooling off breeze in the crypto cryptocurrency market and if we do jump back to the pepe price you can see a little bit of bearish momentum in the cryptocurrency market right now for pepe so this is following what the rest of the cryptocurrency market is doing however saying that i do believe there is long-term price action coming in for pepe over the long term which we're going to talk about soon but before we do i want to shout out this very exciting new crypto and this one is coming up for launch super soon guys so you guys are learning about it very very early and this is called no other than bambit the meme coin cryptocurrency so shout out to bambit for sponsoring today's video and if you guys don't know this crypto i would classify this one actually as a bit of a hybrid so it's not only just a meme coin it actually will have a ton of utility we'll speak about that soon but you can see right here very 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 nice icon so good a uh, graphic good color grading on the uh, panda icon right there big fan of that this one will be running on the solana chain as well home to a lot of big cryptos nfts will also be part of the ecosystem for bambit right here and uh this big utility it's bringing out you know it's not looking to just be an average meme coin so it actually is bringing out a lot of stuff so you can actually see right here virtual card so bambit's virtual card is your passport to a hassle-free spending in the digital realm no no KYC required. So that is impressive. You can use it on your favorite online uh, shopping places right there. You've also got Bambit Games. So they're looking to build out a big gaming ecosystem within this crypto as well. And you also have those NFTs that we just mentioned before and airdrops as well. So that is looking exciting as well. Airdrops, NFTs right there. The ticker is going to be Bambit. There will be 0% taxes on this. The LP tokens will be burnt. The Mint and Freeze Authority will be revoked, which is very nice. They've also had an audit completed as well circulating supply 100 percent total supply going to be 80 million bambit and the token address is right there and in addition they are building out some very nice culture within this crypto so you guys can see these comics and this is just one piece of the artwork they have developed so far but i bet there's a ton of things to come and if we do take a look at the roadmap you guys are learning about it super early right now because it is launching today but they will be having a lot of marketing happening for this coin market cap fast listing deck screener ads plus a lot more basically building out a huge ecosystem big roadmap right here in terms of launch this one is launching literally today june the 11th pretty much midnight utc times so 11 59 p.m right there or 6 59 p.m cst time and it will be launching onto the solana chain so what i'm going to do is going to leave a, a bunch of links in the description of this video where you guys can do some more research into this crypto project and if you do have any types of questions for this crypto project best place to ask questions 
will be the Telegram. So I'll leave a link to the Telegram, but very exciting project to have on the radar early right there. And if we do jump back to some price analysis for Pepe, you know, what will reverse this? What will set off a bullish trend for Pepe over the medium and long term? Let's talk about some of these factors right now. So, you know, there is analysis out there that we could be experiencing more bullish uh, momentum coming in uh, in the next week. Having said that, I am a believer, you know, what's going to be important for the crypto market. It's definitely going to flow back to what is happening with Bitcoin. So if we actually jump to the Bitcoin price, you know, I'm a believer we do need to, you know, break some of this momentum. We have to get out of this zone. I do think it's important for us to kind of get out of this zone. You can actually see we've been actually being in this zone for many months right now. So even when we're talking about Bitcoin, I do feel this does impact the Pepe price. So you can see right here, this is the box we seem to be trading trading in right here. So it's from around, you know, low 60s. In the moment, we're high 60s. We nearly kind of got out of it here with the all-time high of Bitcoin. But I do think, you know, we are, we need to kind of crush this level. So we need to get $75,000, $80,000 Bitcoin. We want to see that institutional money, you know, continue to come into uh, Bitcoin. That's going to be very good. Uh, in terms of, you know, Pepe specific catalysts, now, I'm also a believer what would really, you know, reverse some uh, downwards momentum for this crypto is I would love to see, you know, I would love to see Coinbase, you know, really get on board with Pepe. So we do know Coinbase is definitely a factor for Pepe. Uh, they've listed the futures. So I think it's just a matter of time before, you know, Pepe gets a very solid uh, spot listing on the Coinbase cryptocurrency exchange. And if we do actually take a look at the volume numbers in crypto, you know, one thing that's going to be fighting for Pepe in Pepe's corner is the volume. So again, you know, we're sitting nearly at 1 billion volume, we're sitting at around 817 million. And this is higher than uh, many other cryptos out there. So again, you know, it's bigger than SHIB. So SHIB's got 570 million volume, Pepe is nearly a billion. And it's uh, bigger than Doge as well. So again, Pepe is bigger in terms of volume, SHIB and Doge. Both of these cryptos have been listed on uh, Coinbase. So that would definitely be a bullish factor to watch out for Pepe uh, in the immediate term. And again, more organic exposure, bigger you know, X community for this crypto. That's what's gonna send the price of Pepe up over the long term. So that's what I would love to see. And we also have to you know, factor in those macroeconomic things happening around the world. So you know, this year, so this year, particularly in the United States, guys, it's gonna be a big year. We got the US presidential election. We're going to see what the SEC does and uh, what happens with the global economy as well. So these are all kind of big macro things that can definitely play a role into what happens with the Pepe price. But right now, guys, I'm staying long term bullish, even though, you know, there is volatility in the crypto market. So if you guys enjoyed this update, uh, subscribe, hit the notification bell. We'll have more Pepe updates coming up in the future. But guys, really appreciate you tuning into this one. Go have a good one. I'll see you guys in the next video. Crypto Zeus signing out.